Hello, everybody. This is Appa Brian and Appa Baseball Classics. Well, the issue is settled in the American League. The championship game will be the Athletics at the Yankees. Today, we'll decide the championship opponents for the National League. The Cubs are already in. Today, we have the Braves at the Dodgers. The Braves reached the semifinals by beating the Reds 7-1, and the Dodgers defeated the Pirates 3-2. Here's the starting lineups for today's game. For the Braves, Mike Kelly will lead off and play left field. Hank Aaron in right field. Chipper Jones at third base. McGriff is at first base, the crime dog. Dale Murphy in center field. Eddie Matthews is a DH. Joe Torre catcher. George Wright at shortstop. And Rabbit Moranville at second base. For the Dodgers, Maury Wills at third base. Jackie Robinson at second base. Zach Wheat in left field. Joe Medwork in right field, Mike Piazza is the catcher, Duke Snyder in center field, Gil Hodges first base, Steve Garvey the DH, and Pee Wee Reese is a shortstop. Pitching for the visiting Braves is Albert Spaulding, and for the Dodgers, Don Drysdale. <laughs> This is Apple Baseball Classics, where yesterday's stars performed through cards and dice. Classic games on our tabletops. The Big D, Don Drysdale, is a grade A pitcher with X and Z modifiers. He's ready to face 30 batters before his fatigue point comes. And Mike King Kelly steps into the box for the Braves. We'll read the blue die first, the white die last. 54 is a fly ball to Joe Midwick in right field. He puts it away, one away. That's how today's game begins. Henry Aaron steps up to the plate. Bases are clear. 54 is another fly to right. Two outs, and now Chipper Jones. 44 is an 8 against an A. That's a fly ball to center field. Duke Snyder is under it, and three fly balls. The Braves are retired. No score. Dodgers coming to bat. A lot of speed at the top of the Dodger lineup. Maury Wills will lead off. He's followed by... Jackie Robinson is the pitch to Maury Wills from Albert Spalding, who is a great A, YZ pitcher and rated the pitch to 35 hitters. 32 is a ground ball to second base. Moranville to McGriff quickly, and Wills is retired. That brings up Jackie Robinson, who was one for three with a double and run scored in the first game. 53 is a 19. Both teams are feeling calm. One, and that is a ground ball to third base, which is Chipper Jones. He's a feeling calm two, and that's going to be an error on Chipper Jones. So Jackie is at first base, a threat to steal second. E29 stealing. Spalding's move to first is zero. And Joe Torre is plus three, so to his favor, 26, chances to be safe. 11 through 52. Jackie will take that chance. Here's a, he's gunned down by Joe Torre, caught stealing. George Wright applying the tag. Two to six is the scoring, and there's now two outs for Zach Wheat. 42 is a 9 against an A pitcher. They ground out to the shortstop. Dodgers are retired. We go to the top of the second inning. Nothing, nothing. The crime dog, Fred McGriff, will lead off against Big Don Drysdale. He is six foot five out of Van Nuys, California. A right-hander who throws from the side. Here's a pitch to McGriff. 24 is a swing and a miss. Strike three. First strikeout for Drysdale. 
Here is Dale Murphy, the center fielder. Fly ball to center field. Duke Snyder is under it and makes the catch. Two away. Eddie Matthews. 55 is a 8 against a, a pitcher. Fly out to center field. Go to the bottom of the second. Braves nothing and Dodgers nothing. Joe Medwick will lead off for the Dodgers. He was one of the main players in the 1941 Dodgers National League Championship team. There's a pitch to Ducky Medwick. 3-6 is a Y, and that's going to be a strikeout. Spalding has the Y strikeout modifier. So Medwick goes back to the dugout, unhappy, taking a called third strike. Mike Piazza, the catcher. 336 and 41 homers on his card. 32 is a grab ball to second base. Piazza's retired. That's two outs. And now the Duke of Flatbush, Duke Snyder. 6 4 is a base on balls to Duke Snyder. He'll take his free pass and go to first base. E23, which goes to E20, stealing. He's going to hold and let Gil Hodges swing away. 3 4 is a fly ball to center field. Dill Murphy is under it and makes the catch. Three outs. We go to the top of the third. There is no score. Donnie Drysdale has retired the first six batters he's faced. He's got uh, Torrey, Wright, and Miranda in the top of the third inning. 3-1 is a round ball to the shortstop. Pee Wee Reese, Torrey is retired. One out. George Wright, a 19th century player. 1-2 is a 29, a roller back to the pitcher Drysdale. And the throw to first. Or X. Uh, Drysdale has an X, X, so that's a strikeout. Already wrote 1 3, so we'll make that a roller to first base. A, ro a roller to the pitcher. There is Miranda. 31 and 9. That's a ground out to the shortstop. So, 9 up and 9 down. Bray's not mounting any offense. Go bottom of the third, no score. All right, Steve Garvey, Pee Wee Reese, and Morty Wills gets over hit in the bottom of the third. Ground ball to second base. Rabbit Moranville is up with it and throws to Fred McGriff for the out. One away. Third stop, Pee Wee Reese. That's going to be a base on balls. Second walk surrendered by Albert Spaulding. Reese is at E27, which translates to E24 after the modifications. And um, 11 through 46, he'll be safe. Dodgers have had one caught stealing already. Uh, Maury Wills comes to the plate. Got 331 on his card. Prospects are good for a hit and run play. And we'll go that route. Dodgers will start the runner. And Wills, who holds the bat straight up and down and a little bit away from his body, will be swinging on this pitch. There's the pitch. 4-6 is a 29. Nubbed off the end of the bat. Pitcher makes the play. He gets the out at first with Reese going to second. Two outs. And that brings up Jackie Robinson. Jackie reached by air his first time up. Here's the pitch to Robinson. He is hit by a pitch ball. First and second. Zach Wheat. 
Zach Wade is 0 for 4 in the tournament, but a chance to deliver here with two outs. There's a pitch from Spalding. 6-6 six, six rolls, a hit column roll for Zach Wheat. And 1-2 is going to be a single to a base advance. That scores race. RBI for Wheat, and the Dodgers are on the board. 1-0. With two outs, Wheat could try and steal in 22. It's 19, that's not a good chance. Ducky Medwick, 348 on his card, will hit. Grounded on the ground to the shortstop right. He flips to Moranville, covering second. That's the end of the inning, but the Dodgers are on the board. Dodgers won, and the Braves, nothing. All right, Mike King Kelly leads off for the Braves. We're looking for their base hit. Rules to King Kelly as a 19th century player were mere su suggestions. He oftentimes found ways to get around those when the umpire wasn't looking, and Early in the history of baseball, there was only one umpire per game. This a pitch to Mike Kelly, 43. Round ball back to Drysdale. Throw the first, and there's one out. Nothing that Kelly could do unusual there. Here's Henry Aaron. 6-5, popped up. Back toward the screen, Mike Piazza giving chase. Makes the catch. Two outs, and here is Chipper Jones. That's the base on balls. First base runner for the Braves. Two outs, one on for Fred McGriff. Grounded to the shortstop, the throw to first. That's the third out. One nothing Dodgers, we go to the bottom of the fourth. In 1999, a New York Times reporter described Al Spaulding in the following manner. His face is that of a Greek hero. His manner, that of a Church of England bishop. And he is the father of the greatest sport the world has ever known. There are several people who have been considered in the 19th century the father of baseball. But he did, truly did it all, and he, he was a star player. He's a pennant winning manager, and he was a uh, president of the most successful club of his era. Albert G. Spalding, he was 6'1", which in the late 1860s, early 70s, was about five inches taller than the average American male. So he would be a big guy considered in his time. And the big guy Spalding will be facing... Mike Piazza, Duke Snyder, and Gil Hodges in the bottom of the fourth inning. 25 is a ground ball to second base. That's Robert Moranville with the play. One down. Piazza has rolled out the second twice. Duke Snyder. 5-2 is a 27. That's going to be hit on the ground. This time to Chipper Jones at third base to throw across the diamond. Snyder's retired. Here's Gil Hodges. Five three is an eighteen. George Wright at shortstop is a fielding column two, and that's going to be an error. Second error on the Braves. Dodgers have a man on. Not a threat to steal. For Steve Garvey. Line drive to the right center field gap, and Hodges will go to third. Garvey holds at first with a single. Dodgers have him on the corners with two outs. Ninth man in order, Pee Wee Reese. Infield's playing back with two outs. Fly ball to center field. That'll end the inning as Bill Murphy puts it away. Three outs. Dodgers strand them on the corners. We go to the top of the fifth. Dodgers won, and the Braves, nothing. Braves come up in the top of the fifth. They're still looking for their first hit. Del Murphy, Eddie Matthews, and Joe Torrey scheduled ahead. Here. Here's the pitch to Murphy. Ground ball to second base or X. Darzell has the X. So Murphy is a strikeout victim. One out. Eddie Murphy, or <laughs> Eddie Matthews. 
Four six is a fly ball to center field. Duke Snyder with a catch, two outs. Joe Torrey, roller to Jackie Robinson at second, the throw to first. Three up and three down. We go to the bottom of the fifth. one nothing Dodgers. All right, I'm not a super suspicious kind of guy. I'm going to go ahead and talk about it. Drysdale has allowed no hits through five innings. But uh, Spalding has been keeping his team in the game. He has allowed only one run. Maury Wool steps in for the Dodgers. 1-4 is... Shallow fly ball to left field. Coming in is King Kelly, and he makes the catch. One down. Jackie Robinson. 6-5. Pop up to the catcher. Two outs. And now Zach Wheat. 61 is a 9. He gets an A. That's going to be a ground out to the shortstop. Weeks the third out of the inning. We go to the top of the sixth. one nothing Dodgers. George Wright will lead off for the Braves. He was another 1860s, 1870s star in baseball. Uh, and like Spalding, he also owned a sporting goods company, not as big as Spalding. Spalding's was the largest in the world at that time. Here's a pitch from Drysdale to George Wright. 43 is a ground ball back to Drysdale. He throws the Hodges at first. One down. There's Miranda. Another roller back to Drysdale. Two outs. And back to the top of the order for the Braves. Mike King Kelly, the umpire, is watching closely. 32 is a 26. A roller to Jackie Robinson at second base to throw to first. Kelly's out. To the bottom of the six, one nothing Dodgers. All right, Ducky Medwick, a tough, hard-nosed ball player, uh, has short fuse, would sometimes get in fights with his teammates. So there's a pitch to Medwick, 35, 8. Fly out to center field. Midwick is 0 for 3 today. Mike Piazza. Hit column roll for Piazza. 16 will be a two bagger. That is the game's first extra base hit. Here is Duke Snyder. Fly ball to right field. Henry Aaron is a fielding column one, and that is caught. And Piazza holds it second. Two down. Gil Hodges. Ground ball to second base. They all in the inning. Three outs. We go to the top of the seventh. Dodgers one and the Braves nothing. Hank Aaron leads off for the Braves. He is two for six in the tournament. Here's a pitch by Drysdale. Four three is another ground ball back to the pitcher. Drysdale snags it. Tosses the first. One out. Chipper Jones. Chipper is the only base runner for the Braves. He drew a walk. Fourteen. He draws another walk. One out, and the Braves have a runner at first for Fred McGriff. Grundog has struck out and rolled out the shortstop. Freddie McGriff was two for four in the first game with two doubles and two RBI. Four three is going to be an out. Little roller between home and first. Picked up by Drysdale. His only play is the first base. Chipper Jones goes to the second. Two outs. Dale Murphy. 45 is a base on ball. Third walk given up by Drysdale.
Eddie Matthews could change the complexion of this game in a big hurry. 35 home runs on his Hall of Fame card. Two outs, first and second. Here's the pitch to Eddie Matthews. 41 is a ground ball, or rather an infield pop-up to second base. Caught by Jackie Robinson. That's the end of the top of the seventh. Still one nothing Dodgers. Well, while the Braves are looking for their first hit, the Dodgers themselves have only hit safely twice or three times, two singles and a double, and they've got a, only a slim one nothing lead. Here is Steve Garvey leading off for LA, 51, eight against an A. Popped high in the center field, Dale Murphy's under and makes the grab, and Garvey is one for two in the game today, one for three rather. Here he is Pee Wee Reese. Pee Wee rolls a 2 5. That's another fly out to center field. Two outs. Top of the order and Maury Wills. Thirty one is a nine against an A. Ground out to the shortstop. That's it for the seventh inning. We go to the top of the eighth. one nothing Dodgers. Call your family. Call your friends. We have a potential no-hitter going here in the eighth inning. Don Drysdale has just six outs to go. Joe Torrey, George Wright, Rabbit, Moranfeld scheduled to hit in the eighth inning. 3-4 is a fly ball to center field. Duke Snyder is under it and puts it away with both hands. There's one down. George Wright. 3-6 is a 33. He popped him up. Uh, Jackie Robinson is under it and claims it. Two outs. Rabbit Miranda. 5-2 is a 27. And that is an X. That's a strikeout. Moran Bill goes down looking. We go to the bottom of the eighth inning. Dodgers won. Braves nothing. The no-hitter is still intact. Don Drysdale takes his seat in the corner of the dugout. No one is talking to him. He is left alone to his thoughts. Jackie Robinson will lead off for the Dodgers in the bottom of the eighth inning. 5-1 will be an out. It's a fly ball to center field. Dale Murphy with a catch, one out. Zach Wheat. One five, base hit for Wheat, seven against an A. That's a single. Zach Wheat is two for four. Let's see, he has E22 stealing, 19. Not good enough odds. Joe Medwick is a batter. 1-1 one, one roll for Medwick. That's a hit column roll and a chance for the Dodgers maybe to increase their lead. 1-1's one, a, dr a drive. It doesn't get out of here. It's off the top of the wall. Robinson will score as he tears around third. Medwick goes into third with a RBI triple. The Dodgers lead 2 nothing. Well, that has to work in Drysdale's favor to relax him a bit. He's more concerned about the win than the no-hitter. And his chances to win this game have got, gone up. Dodgers up 2 to nothing. Mike Piazza. Infield playing in for the Braves. 5-5 five, five is a 7. That 7 against an A is a fly ball to left field. We're using the Marino board, so we'll roll to see how deep it is. Kelly is in left field for the Braves. He's at column 2. 4. Uh, the depth is 52. We'll add to that the speed of Medwick at third. Medwick is a 15, so 67. And subtract the arm of the uh, left fielder, Kelly. Let me back up here. Uh, the depth was 52. Speed for... Medwick 15 for 67, so minus the arm. The arm for Kelly in left field is 35. 32. 
chances of score are very high. 11 through 62, I don't do this the way uh, most master game players do it. Um, I will, it's either, an, he doesn't hold, he, he, I decide whether he goes or not. So he's going to try to go, 11 through 62, if he's safe. 63, he is not safe, thrown out at the plate, 7 to 2 for the third out. Dodgers don't add to the lead there, but they do get one in the eighth inning. Dodgers two and the Braves nothing. We go to the top of the ninth. Three outs for Drysdale to go for the no-hitter. All right, Ron Drysdale goes back to the mound. He has faced 27 Braves. He's three away from his fatigue point. But more importantly, he is three outs away from a no-no. Might be interested in the batting averages on these Hall of Fame cards of the three hitters that are going to be hitting. Mike King Kelly, 333. Henry Aaron, 324. And Chipper Jones, 310. A no hitter against this team is not going to be easy. Here's the pitch to Mike King Kelly. 3 4. That's the first one. Fly ball to center field. Duke Snyder is under it. He makes the catch. One away and two to go. Here is Hank Aaron. Right on right. Here's the pitch to Henry Aaron. 3 2. Roller to second base. Jackie scoops it up, throws the Hodges at first. One out to go. That out is Chipper Jones. Here we go. There's a pitch to Chipper Jones. 4-5 is base on balls. And Chipper Jones has walked three times in this game. No hitter is still intact. Fred McGriff, 282 on his card. Drysdale will pitch from the stretch. There's the stretch and the pitch. 2-2 two, two roll. That's a hit calm roll. Oh my goodness. 23 is a double. Let's see, does um, Jones score? He's not fast. Uh, with, with two outs, he does score though. So Drysdale, with two outs in the ninth inning, loses the no-hitter, loses the shutout. Here is Dale Murphy. We're on second. Potential tie and run. So Drysdale's fatigue point came with uh, Jones, and not too bad things have happened. So he goes down to a grade B. Out of the dugout comes the Dodger manager. That's going to be the day for Drysdale. He gets a standing ovation for a tremendous pitching performance. One hit through nine innings. Near no hitter, as close as you can get. Oral Hershiser will be brought in to try to close this game out. He is right-handed, grade B, YZ pitchers. So facing Murphy, who is right-handed, he'll be bumped up to an A for one batter only. Murphy has a potential go-ahead run. McGriff at second for potential tying run. So here we go. Here is a stretch from Hershiser and the pitch. 5-5 five, five roll is an 8 against an A. Grounded to uh, Jackie Robinson at second base. The throw over to first. That's the third out. End of the ball game. Final score, Dodgers 2 and the Braves 1. The Dodgers will go to the National League Championship game. We'll be back with a wrap-up. Quite the game today. The Braves scored one run on one hit and two errors. The Dodgers scored two runs on five hits and no errors. Albert Spalding was the losing pitcher. Nine innings gave up two earned runs. And Don Drysdale was the winner, eight and two-thirds. He gave up one run, Oral Hershiser. Came in to close out the game and get the save. Don Drysdale will be today's MVP. He carried a no-hitter. He walked three into through eight and two-thirds innings. Then he walked Chipper Jones on the ninth. Gave up a double to Fred McGriff. And that was the end of the no-hitter. But he came oh so close. I've only had two or three no-hitters in my tabletop history. I think there was one on the channel about a year ago, and uh, it happened to come on the same day that Sportsman Z had a no-hitter on his channel using uh, Stratomatic Baseball. So quite quite an interesting, interesting day that was. 
um, Zach Waite and Ducky Medwick were the ones who drove in runs for the Dodgers today. Medwick was with a triple in the eighth inning to give some insurance that turned out to be very necessary as the Braves came up with one in the ninth. Hope you enjoyed the ball game. We'll come back with the championship games next. First in the American League. That's going to be the Athletics at the Yankees. And then the Cubs and Dodgers for the National League after that. And of course, those two winners will square off to be the winner of the tournament following that game. And that, so the three games to play in the Hall of Fame uh, original franchise series, All-Stars. Thanks for watching. Have a good day and may God bless.